What's so extra good about it, Pumba? What's so darn extra good about this particular morning that you must rudely wake me up? It's Bestest Best Friend Day! Come again. Bestest Best Friend Day! You know, it's the specialist day of the year set aside for Bestest Best Friends like us! Here, open your present! Well, okay, if you insist. A Mr. Bug Juicer! You like it? I love it, Pumba! Oh, you knew I wanted one of these! All the vitamins without the exoskeleton. This is great, thanks! Anything for my bestest best friend! Now, where's my present, Timon? I can't wait to open my present! I've been waiting all morning! Your present. Right. Well... You didn't forget Bestest Best Friend Day, did you? No, 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 of course not, Pumba. Absolutely not. How dare you even think such a thing? So where's my present? Your present, right. Well, I got you a very special present. Something much more special -er than any normal present. I got you a, uh, a, uh, a... Uh, the Hollow Rotting Log! A Hollow Rotting Log?! But that's what you got me last year! Right, last year. Sorry, I, um, I mean, I got you a, 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 a fungus covered boulder. But that's what you got me the year before you got me the hollow rotting log. How about some dry grass? That was the year before that. Tree bark? Year before that. Dirt. Simone. Yes. You did get me something, didn't you? Of course I did, Pumba. It's just that, you know, rather than spend a lot of time and money, I decided to do something really, really special. What'd you do? What'd you do? I, uh, uh, wrote you a poem. <laughs> oh, boy, a poem? Wow! Written just for me by my bestest pal, Timon. I can't wait to hear it. Can't wait, can't wait. Okay, uh, here it is. My bestest best friend, Pumba. By me, Timon. <clears throat> uh... There's no warthog quite like you, Pumba. I could never find as good a friend. You have got tusks and you smell. You are one in a million. The end. That poem didn't rhyme, Timon. It's free verse. Uh, I don't think so, Timon. I think you just wrote that poem just now. I think you forgot bestest best friend. Day. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Well, it's a dumb holiday anyway, and you made it up. Oh, are you saying you think it's dumb to be my bestest best friend? And what if I am? That I don't think you're my bestest best friend after all. Well, fine. There's a whole herd of warthogs out there, Pumba. And I can easily find another friend as good as you. You're one of a million. Oh. If that's the way you're gonna be, then I'm gonna find me another meerkat that appreciates best as best friends. And I'm gonna find me another warthog even better -er than you. Hmm. Ah. Oh, what makes Timon so... Anyway, all he does is sleep. He just sleeps and rides around on my head and tugs on my ears when he wants me to go fast. Well, I bet I can easily find another bestest best friend if I just put my mind to it. Pardon me. Sorry. Didn't see you.
Perfectly all right. Shouldn't have been crouched over there anyways. You see, I couldn't sleep in this morning. I'm rarely able to sleep in much, so I decided to take a walk. Sure, locals always offer me rides, elephants and such, but I just can't stand riding around on other animals. I enjoy walking, not holding on to some strange animal's ears and tugging when I want to go past. Is that so? Mm-hmm. Anyways, I was walking along here and I got a prickly piece of something stuck on my foot and was trying to get it off when you came along and... Hey, it's gone! Fantastic! Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you very much, Mr. Mr. Pumba! Mr. Pumba. You're quite welcome, uh... Monty. So, uh, Monty, how come you didn't ask your bestest best friend to help you get the prickly piece of something off your foot? To tell you the truth, Pumba, I don't have a bestest best friend. Is that so? Too large. Too tall. Too stripy. Hmm, <laughs> potential. Can I help you with something? Actually, my friend, or rather potential friend, do you mind if I ask you three personal questions? Not at all. First question, what is your name? Bamboo. Second question, if something wants to eat you, what do you do? I run away very fast. Good answer. Now, third question, do you or anyone associated with you celebrate Bestest Best Friend Day? Never heard of it. Perfect. You'll do nicely. Marty! Marty, where are you? Get over here! You gotta see this! Yes, yes, what is it, Pumba? Take a look at what I caught! Isn't it the fattest, juiciest crop you've ever seen? Oh, take it away, take it away! It's filthy and revolting! What do you mean? I mean it's offensive. Aren't you gonna eat it? Eat it? You want me to eat that thing that's not even cooked? But it tastes like chicken! You're kidding, right? You mean you don't eat bugs? No, 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 no! I eat fresh fruits, nuts, and soybean products. Eating insects gives you gas. You don't have gas, do you? What's wrong with having gas? What kind of question is that? <sighs> Simone. Yeah? Ever wonder what those sparkling dots are up there? Bampu, I don't wonder. I know. What are they? They're fireflies. Fireflies that got stuck up in that big, bluish, black thing. Oh. Okay. Uh, Bampu? What? Aren't you now going to suggest, in a droll and simple sort of way, that you always thought they were balls of gas burning billions of miles away? No. Why? Should I? Well, what do you mean? Isn't there another watering hole? Bamboo, my friend. I don't think I like the company. I don't think I'm thirsty anymore, Monty. My new bestest best friend. Monty? <gasps> Bamboo? Monty, is that you?
Oh, you know, the usual stuff, Bamboo. You still an expert at making those fruit nut soybean pancakes I like so much. You still an expert at eating them? <laughs> 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 Say, Bamboo, I've just gotten an idea. Why don't I fix you up a batch right now? That sounds great, Monty. Let's go. You know what, Timon? What's that, Pumba? I disliked my new bestest best friend. Well, if it makes you feel any better, I disliked my new bestest best friend, too. Say, Timon! Did you or didn't you forget Festus Best Friend Day? Well, uh, Pumba, the truth is... Of course I didn't. Oh, boy, I knew you didn't! I knew you didn't, Timon! That's why you are my true Festus Best Friend! So where's my present? Uh, close your eyes. The eyes are now closed! <laughs> You can open them now. Uh, Mr. Bug Juicer! You like it? I love it, Timon! How poetically ironic it is that you got me the exact same thing I got you! Well, life's a crazy thing, Pumba. So, uh, what are you gonna do with the Mr. Bug Juicer I got you? Well, think of something, bestest best friend. We'll think of something. Well, looky here, boys. Let me go! It's a little entertainment prepackaged for our convenience. <laughs> throw them here, throw them here. Let's play some one on one. There's three of us, Peanut Breath. Uh, we could play one on one on one. Skip it. You're catching. Einstein, you're pitching because the name of the game today is. Baseball! Okay, Einstein, how's about giving me one of your famous fastballs? Is that the slow kind? No, a fastball would be a slow ball, only faster! Now just throw the ball! The two. I just don't get any respect around here. <laughs> A Santa Santa squash banana, dirt the port the floor of jungle. La, 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 la. Hmm. 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 Rafiki pass to take a stick. Boom! Fast to do the trick. A Santa Santa squash banana. <laughs> Spirit, I hear your summons. You hear me is what you hear. And I ain't no great nothing. That's the problem. Problem? Yeah. And serving as a major league screwball to three baggy skinned brutes. I just feel so 
demoralized by the crossing of your personal boundary? No, air sick and tired. You see, when you're small like me, you get pushed around big time. Plus, I can't do anything. I can't fly, I can't swim. I want respect. I want status. I want... You want your Rafiki wish, no? Exactly, yeah. What's a Rafiki wish? All the creatures in the fold carry dreams within their soul. Rafiki grant the wish you tell, but only one. So choose it well. You got it, handsome. I wish I were... Such a big hurry for such a little one. Are you sure you don't want to think about it? Let it stir within your spirit. My spirit has been sufficiently stirred this morning, thank you. And I know exactly what I want. I wish I could be tall like the giraffe, swim like the fish, and fly like the bird. With all of that, I'll get respect. You'll get stared at is what you'll get. Respect, my friend, does not come from size of body or cleverness of skill. Respect comes from being noble within. Please, come on, you said any one wish. Very well. Great kings and warriors, past and current, this fellow is a size that he wishes he weren't. Grant him stealth of a bird and the moves of a fishy, the stature of a giraffe, for it is his one wishy. Definitely a piece of work. All right, come with me, you crazy looking thing. Ready? Ready. Then off you go. <laughs> now go, 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 you silly thing. Find your dream, find your happiness, find your respect. <laughs> used to pay me a little more respect. But why should we pay you respect when we can give you grief for free? You know, come to think of it, he is pretty <laughs> impressive. I just thought a creature with his obvious skills would be putting the maneuvers on amateurs like us. Indeed. Why, well, I would assume he would do something like this. <laughs> oh, oh, you mean like this? <laughs> Well, well, I could do that. There's no problem. Yeah, yeah. See? <laughs> Gee, you know, maybe we were wrong about you. Oh, yes, indeed. Why, I'll wager you can probably even do this. <laughs> Finally, a place. 
place where I get the respect I deserve. <laughs> a place where I could do the game playing. Challenged me with a direct assault on my eminence. No, 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 no. I didn't go anywhere near you, eminence. You know what guys like me do with guys like you? We play baseball. <laughs> Home run. Wow. So this is what you do with your powers. Play ball. Seems to me you need a strike in the fish tail, I think. Oh, no, I'm just... Just about to become what you sought to conquer. Let the baseball go. So, noble friend, how do you find your journey toward respect? Oh, it's great, you kidding? Me? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's a little lonely, but I... Tell you what, nobody pushes me around anymore, that's for sure. It is everything you wanted. Size and power. Ah, oh, yeah. you kidding me? It's great. Well, good. Because here you are. Well, well, what do you mean, here I am? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Maybe he's at lunch. Maybe that would be you. Put down my house. <laughs> what is it? It's our baseball, and it's gotten bigger. Looks to me like we're gonna have to think up a new game to play with our little, I mean, big friend. <laughs> well, well, what are you... How's about a little tackle football? <laughs> Thanks, Rafiki. You should see my halftime show. What is the matter now, my friend? Inside, I, I was still just as scared as I was when I was a mouse. I'm nothing but a big, ugly nothing. Ugly, no. Wiser, yes. And if you prefer, you can return to your old self. But uh, I only get one wish, huh? I wouldn't be granting another. Just taking back the first. I can do that. It's in the handbook. Rafiki, I'd like to be back the way that I was. Wrong, Nobi friend. Now you will know that neither size nor skill alone can bring you respect. It must come from within. Thank you, Rafiki. Well, now that your monkey friend is gone, we can get back to the task at hand. And I think I'm in the mood for a little basketball practice. Now listen here. I don't know where you went to school, but I am none of the things you think I am. I am not a baseball, basketball, or football. So you could just find yourself somebody else to push around. On second thought, don't do that either. Got it? <laughs> this isn't fun anymore. And you make a lousy baseball. <laughs> You're welcome, my friend. You're welcome.